Three people stabbed at random in Vancouver's Chinatown. I am so angry. I am white hot angry that this person was released unaccompanied into the community to have a devastating impact. This is where 64-year-old Blair Donnelly is accused of attacking a young woman and a married couple on Sunday. It defies any logical explanation. In 2008, Donnelly was found not criminally responsible for killing his 16-year-old daughter Stephanie because of a mental disorder. The following year, when allowed back into the community, he stabbed a friend. On Sunday, Donnelly was out on another day pass from a lower mainland psychiatric hospital. I'm sure it boggles the minds of all British Columbians, as it does me, uh, that uh, a series of decisions could have been taken that, that landed us in this place. Documents from the BC Review Board reveal Donnelly's last hearing was in April of this year. It was decided he may have escorted and unescorted access to the community depending on his mental condition. A statement from Blaine Bray, the Executive Director of Forensic Psychiatric Services, says when making those decisions, the treatment team considers a variety of factors, including the patient's progress and mental status, and a review process is followed. EB has now promised a review into how decisions were made in this case and whether there are other potentially dangerous offenders that may be out on day passes. Michelle Gassoub, CBC News, Vancouver.